Hems coming up next week with Sutty and Kate. <laughs> Don't tell me. It's a sheep. Yeah. No, it's a dog in a tea cosy. <laughs> Funny. <laughs> or is it an oversized chess wig? <laughs> Here, mind you don't get arrested by the fashion police, you loser. All the other reindeer were wearing leather jackets. It was just my luck to have a mum who's knitting mad. First it was woolly covers for the teapot, the toilet seat, and the TV. And then she started on Ulrika and me. Faster, Rob, you all faster! <laughs> <laughs> I think he's grown an extra tail. No, he's multi. It's a wonder she hasn't thought of making us matching woolly bobble hats. Oh, finished, Romuald. Great, Mum. Life at home was becoming a knitting nightmare. Uh, Romuald? Have you seen my knitting patterns? No, Mum. It's funny. I was sure I left them on the table. There was no way I was going to school looking like that. Mum's knitting teacher came round to see how she was getting on. She thought Mum was brilliant. Mrs. Haroldson, you've surpassed yourself. What delightful matching bobble hats. <laughs> what lucky children you are to have such a clever mummy. So, what's next, Mrs. Haroldson? You seem to have got everything well covered. Well, I was thinking of making wool warmers for the phone directory. Uh-oh. Oh, there they are. I'll be able to start Romuald's jumper after all. Oh. Mum was unstoppable, a reindeer possessed. Nothing I could do but pray for a heat wave. I'm not feeling very well today, Mum. I think I've got a cold. Well, it's a good thing I finished your jumper then. But, Mum, oh. Wear it, Romuald, or you'll freeze to death. How could I tell Mum I'd rather freeze faster, to death? Faster, you all faster! Look, there's a powder puff. No, it's two balls of candy floss. No, it's that sheep, Romwald. Bah, bah. <laughs> Just ignore them. They've got nothing between their ears except their antlers. <laughs> Romwald the sheep. Bah, bah, bah. <laughs> Romwald the sheep. <laughs> I took the shortcut home. 
bump might not knit the most fashionable jumpers in the world, but no one says I look like a sheep. Come on now, just good Liz. Time for your bath. But it's me, Grandpa Ivy. Rob you all. I'm a Christmas reindeer. <laughs> <laughs> I'd been dunked in the sheep dip and Mum was furious, but worse was to come. Hello, I'm Kate Lipton, welcoming you to the Froze Show and this week's competition to find the fastest knitter in Lapland. Mum's knitting teacher had entered her for a competition. Five, four, three, two, one, cast off. Go on, Hilda. You can do it. Go on, Mum. Knit one, bow one. Knit one, bow one. And the winner, with 60,000 rows in just 15 seconds, is Hilda Haraldson. <laughs> and Hilda's prize is to model her very own range of reindeer knitwear on the programme next week. And guess who got to be supermodels for a day? And now, The Froze Show proudly presents Hilda Haraldson's very own Romuald. <laughs> and Ulrika modelling her summer beachwear. in antler couture, the reindeer wraparound. I thought I'd never be able to show my face in public again. But when you drop a stitch on a TV fashion show, things have a funny way of catching on. Hello, Rummy World. Hi, Rummy World. Hi. Yo, Romuald, saw you on telly, wicked threads. Yeah, really kicking. Your mum's a sound knitter. Everyone wanted a reindeer wrap around, and my mum was a star, thanks to me. Just wait till the girls down the chip shop see me in this. Do I look good or what? Cool. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> what a bunch of chunky nits. <laughs> Romuald and his family are back next week on Children's BBC and stick with us because Popeye is next. Great balls of snow, are we still talking about the same beer? Boom.